Hi there, this is Jeremy from Speak Your Mind, and today we're going to talk about how to download and unlock the Speak Your Mind app. Let's get started. Here's what you need to get started. You'll need an Apple or Android device, and you'll need your Speak Your Mind student book. If you're using an Apple device, download the app from the App Store. Search for Speak Your Mind Learning English. If you're using an Android device, download the app from the Play Store. Search for Speak Your Mind Learning English. Once your app is downloaded, open it and the login screen will appear. Tap on Create New Account. Create a username and password following the instructions on the screen, then enter the rest of your details. Tap Create My New Account. A message will appear asking you to check your email. So go to your email program and find your account confirmation email. Remember, if it's not in your inbox, it might have ended up in your spam mail folder. In the body of the email, tap on the link. Your web browser should open a window confirming the completion of the registration process. Keep this window open. Next, you need to find the screen to enter the code from your student book to unlock your level. Tap on the two lines at the top right of this window. Tap on the arrow next to your username and tap Profile. Scroll down and tap User Details, then tap Edit Profile. Scroll down to find Other Fields. Tap Other Fields and carefully enter the code from your student book. After this, tap Update Profile. Great! Your level on the app should now be unlocked. Go back to the Speak Your Mind app. Log in with the username and password that you created earlier. At the top of the screen, tap on Site Home and then tap on Available Courses. Scroll through the list and you'll find that your level is unlocked. Tap the level and you'll find a complete list of the contents. Now you can access the contents for your level on the Speak Your Mind app whenever you want. So there we go. Now you've downloaded and unlocked the Speak Your Mind app. I hope this video has been useful. If you have any questions, please do get in touch and see you in your next lesson.